Hard Huntington Tattoo Company is a business I started about three years, almost four years ago now. Um, it was basically just a drunk conversation one night. I just moved back to Vegas again and uh, I want to open a tattoo shop in Las Vegas because I'm obviously pretty heavily into tattooing. And it's just going to be like a fun project, just like a little side deal. And one thing led to another, I had a conversation with George Malou who owns the Palms Hotel and he thought it was a great concept and six months later we were open. And in the process of opening, we started shooting a pilot for a reality TV show. We started off with a very small, small contract, started off with eight episodes. Got through shooting eight episodes, then we got a phone call, they want to do 14. Did 14, then we got a phone call, they want to do 22. <laughs> and then we did 22, so, and it just really just snowballed from there. So real life was cool, you know, I had a kind of a front seat for the train wreck. You know, I was, I think probably when they were doing all the casting, they expected me to be like the wild, crazy tattooed guy. and. I'm pretty low-key and laid back and mellow. You know, when I'm not on my bike, I kind of let my riding speak for it. So uh, it was, I was kind of like the dad of the house, actually. Like, I was kind of the mediator and had to jump down some people's throats a couple times, but nothing too major, and just try to keep the peace in the house. I don't really see myself getting like the whole TV or movie thing after that. I, I've kind of dabbled, I've had fun doing it. I've done some cameos in different movies, and you know, I, I, I get so critical of myself. If I, say, if, I, if I feel like I'm saying something goofy, I just can't do it, and I get rattled, so uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm really gonna do. I'm just gonna uh, slowly just deal with my tattoo empire and fade, fade in the distance, go surf.